Are you a can you go to www.als.net, www.als.net? With the Gucci, will the Gucci lot on Little River Systems? I was asked earlier, what ever happened with that Lot Paw River water trail? And I do have news to report. The simple version is www.als.net. fishing, boating, and the river is coming out of the oak tree, which is where it gets the tannin color. If you scroll down a little bit, let's just look at the pictures because I don't want to take up too much of your time. That one is what's going to be the front cover of the brochure. The brochure is being printed as we speak on tabloid sized paper, two eight and a half eleven put together. It's going to be Z folded. So as folded, it will be the same size as one of those brochures or cards you see in the tourist centers. Just have the point. And there'll be 5,000 copies of it. And we've already contacted Georgia Tourism and, of course, the Dallas Allowance Tourism, Hampton Tourism. So we'll be distributing it. And, of course, you can have as many as you like. If you scroll down, those are the uh, students. Uh, three out of four, the one in the stripy shirt, she's the winner. The blue shirt, uh, she was third place, second place, couldn't make it. And the other one's an honorable mention. White Chair of the Chris Graham, Chair of the Committee, and Deanna Miracles in red. She ran the contest. Just go around a little more. Everybody likes the counting around here, so we got $500 from Georgia River Network, another $250 from Hamilton County, $500 from Dallas and Knox Tourism. Spent almost all of it on printing. And um, we're going to be doing signs next. Those are going to cost a lot more than the remainder, so we'll be going around to businesses. Any suggestions as to who might want to also donate or sponsor? This is going to be in the same document. And your name is right here on the sponsor list. Your name, Dallas Alliance Development Authority, has been on the announcement of the conference where we said who the winners were. It was in the five different news stories that went out, and it's going to be under 5,000 copies of this. So we do appreciate the letter that you wrote. And then just scroll down a little more. Uh, there's a lot more on the website, just if you're interested, follow the link for that. And this is also in the brochure. There's a map on the website. There's an interactive version of the map. It has a lot more detail. It shows all sorts of put-ins and other interesting information. That's at the uh, Dead River Sink down in Florida, where the Alabama River goes down into the aquifer. If you scroll down just a little more. And that's a waterfall on the Lapagucci River, interactive map. And if you could back up to your previous back button. And let's, let's scroll up now. And click on this thing. The, the one at the right at the top. Okay. This is our next outing, which is coming up on Memorial Day. <coughs> this, uh, Gwyneth Moody is the Water Trails Coordinator of Georgia River Network. She's coming down to see all this. 
and it's kind of composite. Uh, I wasn't familiar with Lake Lewis until recently. It's, uh, it's an old mill pond, Edwards Mill Pond, near Nashville, Georgia, which is a bird rivery this time of year. Last time we saw dozens of species of birds, it's like boating through bird paradise with nests at every level, and they're all in there flapping. And then we're going to boat on the Alapaha River, scroll down a little more. There's a whole bunch more outings, uh, which is just my past. Um, which uh, all summer we already had these scheduled. We'll be adding more, so there's always opportunities. And at every one of these, we'll of course be handing out a brochure advertising the economics and recreational benefits of this, and it will say about Austin Miles Development Authority and every one of them. So thank you for your letter. And yes, we have a report. Oh, I'm John Quarterman, president of Falls Water State College. <laughs> Anyone else, Mr. Jerome? Glad to have you pass.